what is the thinking about why this disease sort of has suddenly emerged and has such a devastating effect? The devils are all very closely related genetically. Being on an island, uh, that's what happens. And they'd probably bottleneck genetically in the past. That is, uh, either as a founder population when they got to Tasmania from mainland Australia or uh, since then. Uh, the disease in this current form is thought to be quite new because it, they're already recording uh, evolution of strains and you can back calculate to through that process to um, probably how long the disease is um, has existed. Yeah, so the devils um, have a similar lack of resistance to it because they're, they're kind of inbred, so their immune systems are all similar. Oh, so this no. disease seems to go under the radar. Uh, and But where there are, is some genetic variation, and we're hoping just enough in some places. But until that becomes obvious, one has to cover your options by trying to manage the situation. Right. There are also right. problems in that if the devil becomes very rare they will be somewhat backfilled by other species and they may not be able to recover like uh, as they normally would be. Like we have feral cats, some evident of foxes here, exotic species that uh, may partly backfill the niche of the devil. I met the Tasmanian devil Thought it wasn't in hell I met the Tasmanian devil And that's the story I was telling you today Oh yeah, don't be afraid.